Welcome to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to stake sand using MetaMask. I'm gonna break this down into four easy steps. The first one is to download MetaMask and install it on your computer. We're gonna be adding the Polygon network onto it because we wanna save money. The second step is to sign up on Sandbox using our MetaMask wallet. Number three is gonna be buying sand from an exchange. And then the fourth step is to stake it. Why do you want to buy sand? Well, it's actually a great play if you're looking at the metaverse and the growth that's happening with it. Sandbox is actually one of the largest ones that are out there right now. This is not financial advice, but we are at a low point right now in the crypto market, and it might be a great time to buy. And if you want to hold it, earn interest while you're doing it, then sand might be the right way to go. You're earning approximately in the high 30s, low 40s, APR. Sand is risky because it does fluctuate like most of the crypto market, but overall it has a lot of growth opportunity. So do your research, check it out. It might be a great opportunity for you. For everything I'm doing in this video, there will be links in the description so you can go through it step by step. Some of the links I've added in the description below are referral links to help support my channel. Don't feel any pressure to use the links, use whatever you're comfortable with. Let's install MetaMask and add the Polygon network to it. So we're at the official website, which is metamask.io. And what we want to do is click on the Chrome extension here that we see and scroll down and click on install MetaMask for Chrome. It's going to take us to the Chrome web store. We're over on the right hand side. You'll see add to Chrome. We just need to click on that. You just click on add extension right here and it's going to add it to your browser. Click on get started. We're going to create a new wallet. So let's click on that. Here is the user agreement. We just have to click on I agree if we want to continue. And now we have to create a password. Now you can create any password. It has to be at least eight characters. Alphanumeric with some special characters might be great. Go ahead and type that in. Okay, so we have the password in. So we want to agree to the terms of use. In this example, I'm not using this wallet, so I'm going to show you my secret phrase. You want to make sure you actually keep this private and don't show it to anybody. Write it down, copy and paste it on a text file and print it. Put it somewhere safe so no one else can see it. Once you have that stored, you can click on the next button. Now it's gonna ask us to verify the secret phrase that we just received and what we have to do is put it back in order. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the phrase back in the way I received it. I'll speed up through this process. There you go, click on confirm, we're all done. Go ahead and click on the all done button and now MetaMask is installed on your Google Chrome browser. Now that we have it installed, we wanna go ahead and add the Polygon network to it. I'm gonna put this link to the official Polygon developer website where it gives you all the network information that we're gonna copy and paste it. You always wanna make sure that you're using the information directly from the source, otherwise you might be losing your crypto. So what I'm gonna do in this point is I'm gonna go over onto the right-hand side. Right now it's Ethereum net mainnet is selected over here. That's the default one. We wanna to go to add network. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna copy and paste all the information from the left-hand side to the right-hand side. So the main net is gonna go into the network name and then we're gonna add the URL to the new RPC URL and then the chain ID. Next is gonna be the currency symbol and then we can use the block explorer URL. Scroll down and we can click on save. And now we just added the Polygon network to MetaMask. We're done with the step. Now we're ready to create our Sandbox account. Okay, so we have Google open and we're just gonna search for the sandbox and here is the official url it's sandbox.game we're going to click on this and it's going to bring us to this home page right over here and on the right hand side you see a sign in link right here so this is going to be the same thing for signing up we're going to click on sign in and what we want to do is sign in with our metamask account and create our account with that and now what it wants is your email address and nickname so we're going to go ahead and type that in right now and then you can click on continue now you get a sign request over here you just click on the sign button and the last step is to type in a password. So go ahead and do that here. And now you can click on save. So we've successfully signed in. You can see over here in the top right hand corner, we have a new sign and our profile information and everything is now in here. We've created an account and we're ready to go on to the next step. So we just created our sandbox account and we're ready to buy some sand. In this example, we're gonna be using Binance, which is Binance.com, uh, but you can also use KuCoin, you can use Endax. These are the ones I'm suggesting, but really you can use any exchange. Now, once you're signed into Binance, what you can do is go over here to the buy crypto option up at the top. And what you wanna do is put some funds into your account. And you have many different options to do that. You can just pick which one's best for you. And once you get to the buy crypto page, you can just go ahead and enter in the amount that you want to put in here. 
whatever dollar amount, it's putting $1,000. And you're going to be buying something called BUSD. Now, I'm showing you the simplest way to do it. BUSD is a stable coin, and it mirrors the US dollar, so it doesn't fluctuate much at all, so it's easier to make purchases. So you can go ahead and buy your BUSD, and then we'll make our trade. Now that we have some BUSD, we can go ahead and trade for sand. And we're going to go up here. And the easiest way to do it is to just use the convert tool. There's also trading tools if you want to go for the best possible price, but I'm going to be doing the simplest way to do it. And that's just to use this convert option. And it brings us over to this portal. And what you want to do is select BUSD because you just purchased that. And we're going to pretend that we have a thousand dollars here. And then in below, what we want to do is select sand and you click on sand. So now you can preview the conversion and then go ahead and make your purchase. All right, and now that you've made your purchase, you can go head over to the wallet section over here and it says Fiat and Spot. We're gonna select that. And now in the list, you're gonna find sand and I have a little bit of sand right now. Uh, you're gonna select the withdrawal option here and sand is gonna show up. And then you wanna put in the address. Now the address that you wanna put in is your MetaMask address. So you can just go up into your MetaMask wallet, copy your address and then you'd paste it in. And the network you're gonna be selecting is gonna be Ethereum. If Matic is available, you'll be saving on fees, so you can select that instead. And you select your network there, and then you can go ahead and withdraw it, and it's gonna send it to your MetaMask wallet, and we're done with purchasing and sending our sand. So now we're on the last step, and that is to stake our sand. So we are back at the sandbox page, and what we wanna do is click on our button up here and go to staking. So you can scroll down a bit. They're promoting MSAND, or Polygon Sand, at an APR of 35%. If you have some Matic and Sand, you can do it as pairs and you'll get 50%. And if you have Sand and Ethereum, you can pair that as well, but you have to have even amounts and you get 30%. So what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be bridging my Sand from Ethereum over to Polygon so I can get this 35%. All right, so I have a little bit of Ethereum right now for fees. Here is the sand that I have, it's 422. So I have my Ethereum layer one and I'm gonna bridge it over to the Polygon network. So I have Ethereum, I'm gonna be bridging it over to Polygon by clicking on this bridge button. And I'm gonna do the maximum amount since I have some Ethereum in my wallet that'll cover the fees. We're gonna move this all over to Polygon. And the next step is to just go ahead and click on deposit. And then we're gonna have to approve it. I get confirmation over here in my MetaMask wallet. So I just click on confirm. My transaction has just been confirmed. Now we can go ahead and deposit it and then click on confirm. And now we're gonna add sand to our MetaMask wallet by clicking on this link and we're gonna be switching networks. Okay, so it's switching over here and I'm gonna switch over to my Polygon network. There we go, we have some add it now. So now we have the option to add the sand to our Polygon wallet and we're gonna add the token. Let's go over to assets and see if it's here. So nothing has come over yet, we'll give it a moment. It's en route, we can close out of here. We can see that the sand is still in our Ethereum wallet over here. We're just waiting for it to pop up over here on this side, which is our Polygon wallet. And then we'll be able to go ahead and stake it. Just refreshing my page and there we go. So my M sand has now shown up in my wallet. See it right here. And now we're ready to stake. So let's go over to the staking tab. We can go ahead and deposit it here. I'm gonna click on maximum amount and gas list. So it's saying that it's free. I get nine transactions. So this is new. I didn't know that, but there is no transaction fees. Maybe they're absorbing it. I gotta look into that a little bit better. So let's go ahead and deposit that. There we go. So MetaMask is gonna ask me to sign and approve this and it's being processed and it's successful. So I can go ahead and you can see over here, I have my total deposit of 422 sand and my share is 0.00007%. And it will be claimed in the next six days, 23 hours and 59 minutes. And that is the full process of staking sand. I hope you found this useful. If you did, please smash the like button. If you have any questions, you can go ahead and put them in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.